to D&D Journey of the 5th Edition. Join our various gaming groups as we play the 5th Edition of Dungeons & Dragons. And maybe just hang out and chat about gaming in general. Sit back and enjoy the show. Hi, this is Kelly, a.k.a. Trixie from Ragnarok and Roll, a sign to Ragnarok story, and Tilda Wimblewick from D&D Journey of the 5th Edition. First off, I would just like to say thank you to everyone for listening to our varied adventures, as well as for rating us on iTunes and RPGpodcast.com. If you haven't rated us yet, we would greatly appreciate it if you could. And if you're looking for more ways to support our efforts, we are now on Patreon, a great site where you can help us continue making more podcasts, as well as some special surprises for our patrons. If you can, please look us up at www.patreon.com slash cppn. Every little bit helps. And again, thank you for listening. Okay, so Gunny comes down and bashes and just looks at you with a satisfied look as the bosun is now got a angry troll on him and a freaking war jack, a steam jack, which he knows that a steam jack is not something to trifle with. He's going to go ahead and split his attention up because he doesn't like this. And he yells, sound three bells, as he yells to this officer who's like, what the hell is going on? Because again, human, it's dark. Just noticing that there's a kerfuffle going on over here and explosives on the boat. The uh, bosun is going to stab both Gargosh and Gunny, because he can. He thinks he can. <laughs> he thinks he can. I think I can. I think I can. <laughs> As we have totally misplaced his character sheet all of a sudden. Why is that disappearing? <laughs> Oh, guess he missed his turn. Darn. <laughs> if he misses, can Gunny laugh at him? Because he seems like a proud character that he wouldn't like to be laughed at. Wow. That's all I've got to say is wow. And it's even worse when it's a mechanical laughing at you. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> so uh, first comes with his nifty multi tack the spear thrust to Gunny. And does a solid 17 hit. Yes. As he stabs Gunny for 8 points of damage. Not sure if you could see that roll. Looks like it's in private. And then he turns to Gargosh. And he's basically saying, You thieves and pirates! And he stabs Gargosh with another 17. He's consistent. Yeah, and, and a little bit, yeah. So he's giving oh, you a second belly button for eight points. Yeah, damn. Wow. 17, 17, 8, 8. Boy, that sounds kind of... He so needs <laughs> to die. He's consistent there, isn't he? I'm like going to roll that one more time to see what comes up. A, a one. He just rolled a natural <laughs> one and a natural 20. Gosh. Okay, so he basically is not happy with pirates. And then uh, some stuff's going to happen. All kinds of stuff's going to happen, but Callus is getting a shot first. Yeah. Unfortunately, Callus is pretty much thinking, why are my friends surrounding the guy they want me to kill? Or <laughs> there is the officer over here who's about to uh, ring the alarm bell. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's... Or these two guys that are freaking the fuck out because their friend just blew up on the deck. Yeah, well, they're not a target. My my two, my initial and everything target... everything is within your dark vision. Yeah. You can see the whole my boat initial, from where you are. My initial target was going to be the... Uh, the steam the jack? Mecha- the steam yeah, jack, I can but... Hit, I can hit the bell guy. Um... You think so? Well, no, you're not before they go, are you? Or are you? Yeah, I'm you're right after me. you. Yeah. Okay. Then I will go ahead and do the steam jack to see you do as much damage as I can to him. Okay. Light him up. Ooh. 
Easy light him up. Don't hit the good part. <laughs> All right. And I aim. No. <laughs> Wrong game. All right, okay. here we go. Fifteen. Fifteen. A fifteen will hit. Plus, plus your inspiration, your bardic inspiration. If, oh. if you want, oh, to if use you it. want, to. yeah, yeah. You can always no. hold on to that for when it's a bad roll. Yep, yeah. yep. Yeah. So I will do fourteen points to him. A boom. little part of my heart cringes because that was like a part I wanted. <laughs> <laughs> no, these are precision shots. Okay, is your 15, your 14 hits and uh, definitely makes hits. some crunchy noise. Yeah. As you're just like, oh, how tough can this thing be? Probably pretty tough. I mean, I'm familiar with... Uh, our buddy gunny. here, Gunny. So, and uh, it's uh, this is a full size one, not Gunny that was built out of you know reclamation plant. Yeah. So. So uh, anything, anything for your uh, move or bonus action? Um. No, I don't think so. I think I'll stay in my cover area. You you, you like having some concealment and cover. Yeah, it doesn't hurt. Okay, so Mia, what are you going to do? Um, I am going to uh, use my arcade bolt, and I'm going to light up this guy that is going to try to use the belt. Guy? This guy. I oh, the officer. Oh, okay. Um, do, 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 do. Uh, arcade bolt. Oh, As your oh wait, bolt... I would like to use my inspiration. Okay. Yeah. So, so do I hit Arcane Bolt again, or do I, is that what I do? Uh, you would just add a, a, a D6 to the roll, and roll high. So really high. Like this, well, but no, add just six, a, so... no, no, you'd use no. that 9 oh. that you rolled, and then just roll a okay. D6. Oh, a D6, sorry. Okay. Uh, da, da, da. Okay, come on, D6. Yay! Ooh, 14. As this guy ducks in the last second, your arcane bolt totally hits the mast here, not I him. I want to use one of my focus points. And what does that do? I want to do the one where I get to... Um, I'm going to spend a focus point to take it at advantage. I don't get to roll again, do I? Uh, no, you already have the highest roll, so I wouldn't burn the focus point yet. Because you rolled yeah. a 9 and an 8. Fine, I'm going to marshal Gunny and tell him to... Oh, tell him to drive it back. So that if he, on his next attack, he if he's successful, he can push him back 5 feet. He's going to shove that other, uh, that, that bosun off the deck. Yes, and I'm just going to flip off the guy that dodged. No, I'm going to blow him a kiss since he dodged my, uh... <laughs> <laughs> dodged Look my at your intimidation point. check. Oh, okay. Right. Oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to boogie on up here. Uh, I'm going to try to move if I can click the right buttons. Oop. Buttons can be hard. Button, button, who's got the button? Look at you, you're committing a boarding action. I like that. Means you, yeah. it, it does mean you are next to the guy, if you look in the picture below, this guy. Just to warn you. Oh, wait. And this guy. I'm, oh, it's not two levels? This part of the, level boat, of the boat? This part of the boat is this. Oh. So, so you're basically right here. I don't want to do that. I changed my mind. <laughs> we'll put you on both boats so you can see where you are on the main yeah. deck and where you're running up the poop deck. 
Uh, I'm just going to. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna be right, right here, so I could be looking at people. Okay. I, I just <laughs> figured I'd point that out to you. I thought. I well, thought the bottom one was all downstairs. That's why I was like, no, no. Okay. I don't know how you yeah, pull man. these trick shots, but cool. That's why that's all gray. <laughs> that's why that's all grayed out in the middle, because that's the middle. This is the, the open space. Bottom deck or next deck. These are the raised up poop decks. Oh. <laughs> okay, okay. So. Well, uh, sorry, sorry guys. I thought I got him. This this one sailor's gonna totally tell the the steam jack to go and uh, protect the. Uh, Bosun, don't uh, don't let them kill the bosun. No, oh, no. <laughs> Gunny, please don't fall in the water. As uh, the steam jack will do the lumbering, kadunk, 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 kadunk. So, boys. Basically here, right? So, uh -huh. uh, and he's having to spend all of his movement to get right there, and in, for the extra five feet, his action. Gadunk, 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 and it takes kind of a defensive position behind the bosun. Behind, as he's like. Yeah, as the Howard. bosun looks at him and he's just like, don't protect me, kill them! And it's like... <laughs> <laughs> as it just vents steam out of its backside, it just sounds like a horrendous sigh that I'm like, I'm coming to save you and you're chastising me. <sighs> as then the, the little sailors are all going to jump to uh, action. So this officer immediately reaches over to the pole and goes ding 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 then a pause then ding 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 you kind of think it's not really necessary but they're following orders uh -huh. and uh, these two guys start pulling things off the deck cannon here as in they're thinking of going to use this deck cannon but it's it was covered up and stowed for for docking so now they have to unstow the cannon to use it it's just a little deck sweeper cannon, you know. Can't be that damaging. And <laughs> 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, and pulls his weapon out. The sailor's coming on, and he's confused between this chick or this dude, but he thinks the bosun's got that dude. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. 40, 45, 50. Oh, we got a flanking maneuver here. And then these, these guys are going to go in here, and they're basically captain, captain, getting the captain's attention and probably asking for the key to the weapons. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, and pulling his weapon out, kind of wishing he didn't have just a dagger and a sword. And this guy is kind of doing the same and going, hey, big guy, you're in the way. <laughs> so an interesting end of rounds happen as the, the bells are going ding, ding, ding. And Theo is up. Wow, for Theo being there, there's a very dangerous grouping right there. Yeah. <laughs> Except Gunny's in the middle of it, depending on how she plays things. I know, or Callus. Right? I mean, okay, I just got to point out, if, if she I, drops it here... Oof. Yeah, yeah right if here. I were to drop here... You would hit uh, Gunny with the area effect. It would hit Gunny? What if I were to hit here? Would it hit both those guys? If hit or... this guy, it would not hit Gunny. Yeah, but it would hit this here, but, this here. Yeah, this here. so I'm basically going to aim for this guy. For this guy? What yeah. do you do with the dead man, sailor? What do you do with the dead man, sailor? As she's checking another explosive grenade. Obviously, um, Theo has warmed up her dice from previous yeah. games. Well, you know, and I'm impulsive. I follow my heart. 
you, you know, are explosive. Let's throw it into the middle, you know, because that's the kind of crazy person I am, which will give me inspiration for the next time. This, this will <laughs> give you inspiration on the next time. Okay. This is why you so, spend uh, it so you can earn go. it back. <laughs> 14. 14 will hit the common sailor. It sucks to be a common sailor when a grenade is in the air. <laughs> All right, so, uh, yep, roll for your damage. About time. So what does it look like when your grenade obliterates that guy? Um, basically another uh, flash of light. Uh, people are kind of like deafened and kind of thrown back. But more to the point, there's like red paste and viscous, you know, uh, stuff splattering everyone. And it does five AOAE damage, right? Uh huh. As everyone's taking damage except for you guys. Oof, the bosun's looking pretty rough. Okay, so he is obliterated into a red mist as you guys hear another kapow, an explosive grenade go off. This officer takes, you know, some of the guy's body is frag in the face. The steam jack gets, you know, a scratch on it, which is, you know, <laughs> nothing compared to the bullet hole that's already leaking some steam out of it. And this guy right. gets his backside all blasted. He felt all secure having a steam check to his backside. He just turned his back to a grenade. <laughs> and Gunny just gets to enjoy the smell of gunpowder in the morning. Anything for your bonus action or your movement? I don't know. I think I'm going to stay where I am so that I can hit things. Um, uh, but, yeah, no, I think... Uh, I think I'm good where I am for the moment. I'm not too far away and I'm not too, you know. Okay, so Gargosh, bunch of things are happening. The only thing louder than your voice is Theo's grenades. <laughs> <laughs> um, can I defer to Gunny? Can, can I let Gunny go before you can hold Gunny next? But you, have to, you have to claim what you're wanting. And to you do, do have him. two oh. guys to your backside and one guy. Yeah. You, know, you are surrounded right now. I mean, you can totally hold your action yeah. to do something, but uh, what is it you're going to do? Or you yourself. No. Uh, No, okay, I will... You're totally afraid of getting speared again with that spear, and I can't blame you. Well, it's not that I'm... I, I just... I have so many different things I want to do. I want to... Anyway, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I will... No plan lasts the first second in combat. <laughs> I just don't like being so close to so many people. <laughs> <laughs> I think even Gunny agrees with that one. You use your Can magic or something or something. Uh, yeah, I'm looking. I, I got oh, my magic is stupid, though. Um, <laughs> your magic is awesome. It is awesome, but I don't think that will work on a Mac. Well, don't worry about oh. the Mac. He's yeah. If you're thinking not vicious mockery, yes, yet. that wouldn't that wouldn't work on the Mac. No, I was thinking um, uh, the, the, the dissonant whispers, but that also wouldn't work on the Mac because it's psychic. Um, no, but worry about these right now because these are the ones yeah. that are going to stab you, not him. No, I know, I, I know they're going to stab me, but uh, okay, I'm going to just. Spin around real quick and stab the guy behind me. Okay. The um. This guy color. here who's sneaking yeah. up behind you. He's he's getting yeah. ready to. He's gonna poke you from behind, which is just as bad as getting speared from the front. And it, he do it with advantage. So it is. That, that, that yeah. would be a bad thing. 
I just did that so I know what's coming. One doesn't flank a pirate. A pirate <laughs> flanks. Exactly. So, yeah, I'm going to spin around and... and um, From the yeah, fellow colors, hell, I stab at thee. Exactly. Well, That's exactly... Yes? Well, don't turn around, but turn facing, you know, the, the ship so that they're on the side of you, not totally behind you. I don't know that you want Kish at your yeah. back. Yeah, well, with, with, with the Inca combat, facing really isn't a thing, so... But, but, okay. but yeah, you're, you're keeping an eye on all your combatant enemies. Unfortunately, yeah. the flanking sucks. Yes. Uh, so, uh, so, yeah, I'm going to face the correct direction and stab the guy who's going to stab me in the back. Because you know he's coming for you. Like, They're like, uh, this guy, uh, this guy looks like a pirate I've heard of once. Exactly. So go ahead and give me your damage, as a 20 will definitely hit. And for your four points of damage, what does it look like when you keel haul this bastard? <laughs> um, well, I'm in a panic, so I don't do anything fancy or, or, or quick. I just, I just, you know, open up his belly and then... He glares at the other guy. <laughs> yeah, like you yeah. next if you don't back down. Give him a little um, trollkin grin, and then as my bonus action, am I able to healing word myself? Uh, I believe it's a bonus action spell, right? Yeah. Yes. Yep, then you can totally do it. As you, like, you know, look down at your wound and grab your belly and cast the spell. Nobody makes me bleed me own blood, says the exactly. pirate. Exactly. So, four four points back. That's back to double digits, so yay. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> and I'm assuming you don't want to move and risk an attack of opportunity from uh, Belly Poker here. No, thank you, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Son of a swivel, twisted horse. So it is Gunny's <laughs> turn. Yep, he curses like a sailor. <laughs> <laughs> He's not that kind of sailor. <laughs> so what's Gunny going to do? You may Sorry, you guys, I was talking the whole time and my mute was on. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I've never like, done that. Um, so he's going to come up, he's going to crush, and then if he succeeds, he's going to try to drive him back five feet. Nice. Ooh, I like this. Oh. Oh. Oops. As this guy does a total ole and just dives out of the way with, with that natural one. Oh, I rerolled As, natural ones. Oh, thank but you. that's for Gunny, not ones? you. Yeah, that's for <laughs> Gunny. As Gunny, like, gets pushed back, give me a deck save. As he goes pushing backwards, you know, the guy, he tries to crush, the guy ducks under and puts his spear between Gunny's legs and snaps. Oof. As Gunny crashes just just off camera there onto some stuff that's on the other side of the dock and he's all tangled up in, in stuff. As he'll need to work to get out of that stuff. I've got something for that. Hold on, I gotta find it. <laughs> <laughs> Get out. That's the next marshal. <laughs> Gunny makes a sad sound and just looks at you and lifts his hands up in a shrug. It's okay, Gunny. It's okay. As um, the bosun here screams at his guys to uh, get back and secure the boat. The captain will finish these dogs off. He's gonna 
he's going to be super cocky since he only has single digits as opposed to somebody who's in double digits bragging about healing his wounds. <laughs> and he's going to use his action to disengage. And then he's totally going to oh. move. And he's going to yell at these guys to... Oh, let me move that to the back. Yell at these yokes to get the, the deck sweeper up in operation and shoot these thieving bilge dock rats. But he was blocking me from the mech. <laughs> <laughs> As he's totally yelling at these guys to hurry up as if that would have helped them do the two rounds of prep that that gun needs. It's good to try. And uh, you hear the ding, ding, ding of that. And uh, Callus, what are you going to do? All right. Um, well, we're you have a shoot. feeling that these guys are going to follow orders and fall back. All right. So sweep the I'm not engaged with this guy, right? So I can. I uh, know you've got a little distance. Back. No, you're yeah. just dating. <laughs> uh, so it's a casual relationship. I'm going, to, I'm going to shoot him in the back of the head. You're Ooh. not in the label. <laughs> Poor All guy. Right. Let's see. What do we get? Nineteen. Nineteen will hit. Ow. Nine points. Oh. I like how our yeah. sniper says only nine. <laughs> okay. That would be a horrible combination, multi multi classing gunslinger and rogue. That would that would be horrible. Oh, it'd be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it would be horrible. Anything for your bonus action? Um gosh. Don't think so. I can't think of anything off the top of my head. Been a while since playing D and D. Thinking. Where did I go? In the lineup, I was like after Callus. Is that me? Where did I go? I'm, I'm where going now. Oh, go? Yeah, where did you go? I don't know. Apparently, you disappeared. I know. I was like, wait a minute. I haven't had a turn. I'm after Callus. <laughs> <laughs> Because you had like a 10, yeah. I thought. Yeah, because he, he shot, and then I tried to hit this guy. Mm hmm Yeah. So, uh, yep, I put you back in there. So there's me at 10. That's, that's bizarre. That's how... um, yeah, I don't, I don't think of anything off the top of my head for a bonus action, so. Okay. We're good. So what is Mia going to do? I'm still going after this lieutenant over here, but I'm going to go after him with Chill Touch. Okay, and she's changing up her repertoire. It's like, okay, Ouch. Arcane Boat won't hit you. Ghostly Spectral Hand of Death. 24 will definitely hit. And six points of damage. He does survive the chill touch. But he What's looks like effect? crap. Oh, oh, sorry. I guess I can uh, I'll, I'll click it for you. Oh, do you want me to read it? Oh, no. no, no but but is there no, any okay. effect? Is there an effect? I think there's an effect in there. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Until the next round, he can't, um, he can't, no one can heal him. He can't gain any hit points back. Oh, okay. Cool. As the chill and the touch hand clings on to him. She's so, Mia's so clingy. Anything <laughs> for your uh, move or bonus action? Uh, yes, I am going to Marshall Bunny to uh, get up, and that, that takes off five feet of his ability to move, so he'll be ready to go, and uh, get your lazy ass up. <laughs> I'm, I'm just going to, that's it, that's all I got, I mean. As you totally yell at Gunny, to, Gunny, right yourself. Yeah. So I'll have to steal Gunny and put him back on the map because he's just so just enough off the map that he, I can't touch him. <laughs> now we have two Gunnies. Just like Mia wants. Oh, uh, <laughs> and then because 
they're all running on. Uh, I'm not going to go anywhere because, well, eh, I'll, I'll scoot up a little bit. He's going to come at me or not. I'm going to get up to here because I feel like we're going, going on this boat. Yeah, he's supposed yeah. to be going back on the ship, so. Yep. Yeah. And this officer uh, makes, a, makes a squeaky, squeaky panic noise as the uh, steam jack is following the bosun as he was ordered. <laughs> does he push him in the water? Does he help us out? He does not push him in the water, but he does step okay. on the corpse, which is really <laughs> nasty, as it just makes the sploogy noise of squishy wet socks. Nice. As, you know, it's following orders, which is to protect the boats, and, and it can't go up on the top deck there. It's not even going to try as it just yeah, looks no. and shrugs. So, did you roll to see if the, the stairs held for the, because remember, I blew up the top of the stairs. Well, you didn't, you only did four points of damage, though. Oh, yeah, that's not enough to do a lot of damage. Structures take, like, ten points for it to even notice the damage, other than cosmetic. So uh, sailors are going to, uh, this sailor is going to stab the witch that keeps shooting the office, keeps shooting at the officer with spells before he retreats. He's going to stab you. He's just like, you know what? We're going to do this. We're going to do this thing. Defy orders. All right. Got to always have one of them in the group. Yep. As he takes his little belaying pin and just thunk, will a oh Jesus, will a seven hit you? No. <laughs> I'd be willing <laughs> to Can I then, pop him on the the cheek or something and be like, "Scoot." As you can totally <laughs> pop him on the cheek as he retreats, you do get an attack of opportunity. <laughs> I just one hundred percent. Of uh, um, uh, Kill Bill Part One, where she's like spanking the last one with the sword. <laughs> Go home yeah. to your mama. <laughs> um, I've I've never made like a physical. I, I have to physically hit him, right? I can't throw a spell. Yep. It's it's got to be a basic uh, melee attack. Either, uh, melee attack How or do, weapon attack. I mean, I have I have a knife. Did you I've have your knife sh- out and ready? No, I don't know how to just punch somebody. Do I just roll a D? If you're just going to scoot him with your boot, just you can just roll a uh, strength saving throw and roll 20. It's the same thing as like a punch. Yeah. Okay. And it's one uh, point of damage plus your strength modifier, which is zero. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh! oh. I re roll. I re roll. Oh. So I would have got a 13. So, so would you like to re-roll instead of that natural one? Yes. Do I need to re-roll or do I just take that third? You you would re-roll. Oh, okay, okay. A three. (laughs) As you try to boot him and the deck is moist in the morning, it's got that morning dew on it still, as you just like, whoa, 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 and almost, almost fall over. As wow. the, the oh, sailor God. that swung at you just sneers. He missed you with the seven, but you missed him with the three. It's like watching two kids that have never fought before slap fighting in the hallway. <laughs> <laughs> now you die. <laughs> now top of the order. Oh, oh. Uh, we also have this guy. He's going to slowly pull back, and he's going to hide behind the rails for some cover. Because there is a guy shooting at people he's noticed. And they're just like, lock down the ship. And uh, this door opens up, and these two guys come out with pistols down here at the second deck. Uh And what is Theo going to do? Oh, I'm going to kill the boatswain. Get him. As he's conveniently standing over the dead remains of the one you blew up earlier, as he looks down and sees you and then looks at the dead body at his feet and the railing that's destroyed and goes, "Uh uh-oh. And I'm using my inspiration. So you have advantage. (laughs) 
23. The bosun's not going to have a good day. Now the question yeah. is, will he live longer or no, or unprosperous? Eight oh, points of damage. He is still alive, but he is gushing <laughs> fluids out of every open wound your grenade did to him. He has one oh, point as he is leaning, leaning oh, wow. over the rail, barely alive. Damn. And what about the schmo next to him who would have taken... And the schmo that would have taken five points and then gives the Wilhelm scream as he goes flying off a springboard into the water. <laughs> okay, so that oh. means also the ship right up, right where the bosun is standing has taken ten points of damage. But not in one shot. It's it's ten points in one attack to do, like, structural damage. You, you don't don't worry about your grenades killing the ship. They're, no, they're not really equipped yeah, for that. Don't, don't be beating no, up the No, I wanted him to fall. <laughs> oh, he's, he's only got one point. He's going to fall any moment now. <laughs> he's wheezing out of all these frag wounds on him. <laughs> I, I will point out uh, Theo is winning on the, the kill count here. Not counting games. Oh, look at that. And uh, any, any movements? Any bonus action? No, I don't have a bonus action that I can um, uh, Nope, I'm going to stay right where I am because it's close enough that I can uh, uh, lob. All of a sudden, Gargosh feels very unwanted. Very, I mean, does he smell? What's going on? Everyone left. <laughs> I mean, I do smell. I'm kind of proud of that fact, but... Um, <laughs> So, I've seen lots of measurements you, coming from Gargosh. Yeah, well, I, I'm not that, measuring. <laughs> I oh. am. <laughs> you, uh, I mean, he's only got like one hit point. You got something real simple, a little magic missile or something. <laughs> or vicious mockery. I don't, I, yeah. Vicious mockery would do it. I just charge up and stick him again. <laughs> Here's your yeah, third charge belly up button. past the mech and stick him. Sure, <laughs> uh, <laughs> he won't know. How, how did Gargosh die? He ran past the steam jack, told to protect someone, to attack the target of he, his protection, and yeah, notice. it op it opted for the attack of opportunity to crash the back of his skull. And he won't notice. You go by. <laughs> Excuse anyway, me, so Mister Steam I'm Jack. Yell, yell at the bosun. Don't worry. You'll be just as ugly in the afterlife. Oh! I love it. And uh, what nice. is your spell DC that I have to roll against? Uh, right there. DC 12. Or was that the spell? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, wisdom and that's, save. DC 12. That's a wisdom save. He's got no wisdom. <laughs> and I rolled a oh. 7. And you yeah. only rolled one psychic damage. But <laughs> That's enough! <laughs> what does it look like when you psychic damage him to death? <laughs> he... Um... That's he funny shit. looks confusingly <laughs> at the mech that was supposed to protect him, and then just crumples. Defeated <laughs> in all ways. As the mech looks at him and looks at you and looks at him and looks at you and he kind of waves his weapon between the invisible the line. I mean, Gargosh I mean, didn't want to overdo it, killing him. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you didn't want to make his head explode in a fountain of gore. No. That's my MO. <laughs> I think that he just passed out and still needs protection. That, yeah, that's right. what the Steam Jack's going to think, because he can't check for a pulse. I mean, he it will do like his I duty can't. and stand over the body. Words don't hurt. <laughs> Words don't hurt. <laughs> okay, so what does Gunny do now that he's been commanded to get his ass into gear, literally? Okay, um... <laughs> I don't want him to go anywhere. I definitely don't want him to go near that guy. That uh, Steam Jack makes a great wall. 
Uh, I didn't even think about Gutty. I just was thinking about what I'm going to do. Uh, <laughs> uh, Gutty's, Gutty's, I guess we're, are we going on board, you guys? Uh, yeah, we got to finish what we started. There's I mean, you, you can't Gutty. always retreat and regroup. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll throw bad advice Gutty's at you. Boogie up right. to this guy. And he's going to, uh, because fuck that guy. Uh, he's <laughs> me. And he's, he's running up the crush. other gangplank, and he's going to smash the poor sailor. It's yeah. because you missed that sailor that you got it out for him, isn't it? And your 13 will definitely hit. Okay. Because uh, Gunny's chasing the guy who went after you. And what does it look like when he turns him into a grease stain? <laughs> oh, Gunny, Gunny does his signature move for me. When I'm angry, he punches and rips out his heart. <laughs> 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 Only when it's done by a mechanical hand three times the size of a human hand, it's a lot more gory. Right. <laughs> it's now under the uh, condition of industrial accident. <laughs> and uh, yep, and he's gonna he's gonna stay right there. And I will totally point out. Don't forget, there's. Yeah. More dudes here, yeah. Those two dudes that are down on this deck. Yep, that just well, saw on, this me... horrifying scene of a steam jack just rip out a guy's chest. Uh, let's see, he went 20, he used 5 to get out, that's 25, he could move 5 more. He could step on the corpse. Yeah, let's do it, it'll freak him out, sure. <laughs> um, and can he growl, just like, Argh! <laughs> Metal fatigue sound. Yeah. Uh, these guys feel very, very, very fragile with their tiny little flintlocks. <laughs> Sir, Are can we just... have the big gun? Okay, so what does the bosun do? Well, he dies in psychic agony, saying, I'm going to be ugly in the afterlife. <laughs> <No>! <laughs> Not the ugly afterlife. I wanted the pretty one. So, Callus, you you yeah. see lots of gore happening. There's lots of noise. The sun is just starting to crest on the horizon. As you realize, the, the darkness advantage will probably be fading quite shortly. Yeah, that's all right. All right, moving up a little bit, and then we're going to shoot. It will be these guys' last sunrise. <laughs> Gonna shoot uh, the big tin box. Shoot the steam jack. Yeah. Callus has been relentless here. He's so glad that that thing was told to protect the bosun because now it's not coming after him and it's just standing there getting exactly. full of bullet holes. Exactly. Okay. All right. Sixteen will hit. Fifteen points. Damn. Damn. Whoa. As, uh, what does it look like when your shot hits him somewhere vital and something necessitary comes <laughs> blasting out of the bullet hole? Um, basically hit the, uh, the, uh, hydraulic system, blowing the pump out. Just, so. As he Just sadly bends out over. steam out the back. Gouts of steam bellowing everywhere. Is he looking pretty rough? Like, can he's, I tell? Does he, he is look pretty deactivated. Rough? He is. He's done with that fifteen points. That that did this guy in. He's that like, why did? <laughs> why didn't I get provided my proper armor? Why am I wearing this mariner crap? <laughs> okay. Anything for your move or your bonus action? Well, I already moved up a little bit, so oh, okay. no, um, I'm good. Okay, so Mia, your steam um, jack's getting all frisky following your orders. Can can I holler something without it counting as an action? You can talk, yeah. I'm going to tell uh, Callus, you have never been more handsome. <laughs> you <are>. <laughs> <laughs> I have never loved you more. And I am going to shoot. 
another chill touch to my same little lieutenant because Ooh. I'm going to see if I can kill him. As the little uh, hand grip is dissipating, you're sending another one after him. Yeah. No, touchy, touchy, touchy. But apparently you're touchy, touchy, touchy. <laughs> and uh, what's your damage? 16, 16 will definitely hit. Will you roll? No, right. you did uh, not what? roll more than three. Okay, the chill touch hits him oh, for wait. two points of damage. Wait, wait, I can use a focus point to increase my damage. Ah, now, is right? that with your spell or is that with a magic weapon? God, dog it, I gotta get a magic weapon. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, I'll use, can, I, um, I can't use the inspiration to get more damage, can I? Nope. No. Dog it. That's all right. Okay. So, uh, needless to say, the steam jack on its turn, <laughs> it's totally just belching fluids out of the f- hole in it. You just see it make this coughing motion, and this gout of hydraulic fluid goes out with water. Ew. Yep. Yep. And um, that's fine. <laughs> there's this bellowing command coming out of the door here which you obviously think is the captain coming out to play soon, as this guy is totally told to get the hell out of here. And he is totally going to come and flank with his buddy. (laughs) So they both have advantage, but they're shooting it adjacent with range, which gives you disadvantage. So it's just clean dice rolls as they both hold up their flintlocks to Gunny and pull the trigger. The first one is going to be rolling plus three. Nine points as the round ricochets point blank and the guy ducks as he pulls the trigger and hears the twing. And the second guy, damn, puts one. He rolled 19 points of damage. He rolled 19 to attack. No. Oh, I was like, I... I give up with these. I just, I'm going home. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, okay. if it's a flintlock that does 19 points of damage, I need to get some more of them. Yeah. I was going to say, I need I'll one, of those. one of those. <laughs> okay, so I'm down six hit points. Or he, uh, he is. I haven't rolled damage yet. As uh, he, the, he, he pulls up the gun to the back of Gunny's head and pulls the trigger. <laughs> for four points of damage as he's looking very, very proud of himself as he now realizes his flintlock is empty because he does not have a reload. As they, like, feel a little bolstered, but we're gonna we're gonna get some saving throws just in case. This guy is totally running in the door. He's running away. He's basically well, going get, down. Are you gonna talk about opportunity? Gunny does get an attack of opportunity. That's right. He made him so mad. <laughs> uh, is that just a like just a crush? It's just a oh, straight, straight a straight straight uh, crush attack? Yeah. A straight crush. Okay. Come on, Gunny. Woo! That will hit. <laughs> oh, what does it look like when the guy opens the door, which is to the mess hall, and Gunny just? grabs him from behind and keeps him from doing that. You mean you Gunny grabs his neck, that? so his head and his neck stay, but his body keeps going. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that is a mess in the mess hall. <laughs> this, is, this is what fear will get you. It will get your head squished off. Yep. And then he's just gonna, like, Gunny's just gonna kind of, like, Turn the head in himself to look at the other guy. Oh. Uh. So these two guys have finished reading the cannon, by the way, as you see them swivel this this it's, it's only like a like a four inch barrel cannon in your, your general direction. And uh, this guy is loading it currently. When when he has finished it his next turn they will be able to fire this cannon. So I'm 20 feet from the cannon. You can totally take a step forward if you want to risk being at the edge of the dock. Do it. Get up. What's the worst that could happen? 
Johnny will go um, in. Nope. I'll come well, in after you. No, know, I am impulsive and I follow my heart. <laughs> well, you did earn inspiration already. Yeah, and she does love Gunny. She does love Gunny. All right, so here we go. Oh, oh my God, I to take off the little thingy. I got I can hit him, too. And you got to take one step forward. Trying. This way. There you go. As she is on her tippy toes. So basically, I am going to launch it right here. At this guy? Yeah. Okay. It's going to affect, every, you know. And she's burning everything. her inspiration. Okay. Well, better believe it. Here, clicking it off. Uh -huh. All right. Ah, uh, big bucks, big bucks, no whammies. Um, that's a twenty. That's a twenty. <laughs> if you roll a natural uh, twenty, yeah! I will give you that you take the cannon out as well. By the way. Awesome. So roll your damage. What does it hey. look like when your grenade hey. goes flying into the little powder keg, killing both of them and disabling the cannon? Um. Like, all the other little explosions that, I say little, <laughs> all the other explosions were like, you know, this was boom. <laughs> As you basically just took out all the powder keg they had yeah. up there. Exactly. And the uh, cannon actually goes flying off <laughs> into the water. Sploosh. There's this big splash. But as it did, it took the head off of this one um, uh, <laughs> into the water. Now we got to replace this guy's the cannon okay. if we take the ship. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> well, we would have had to replace it anyway to get this kabooey. <laughs> and um, do me a favor. Give me a uh, deck save if you want 12 or higher. Oh, shit. Otherwise, I'm swimming. <laughs> uh, other other words, you're falling in the water where there's a bunch of heads already being dropped. Yeah, okay, <laughs> all right, hold on. Okay. That's a <laughs> going in after that's the six, uh, 13, okay. that's good enough. So so we will be calling Theo, Twinkle Toes Theo, as she holds on with her <laughs> heels to not fall off the deck after she threw this beautiful <laughs> shot that just went off like the 4th of July and she's too busy enjoying it to realize it's her footing, but she hooked her shoes just right to not fall off. I caught my balance. So, uh, Gargosh, all kinds of crazy shit's happening. Well, then, uh, can I complete my movement and move back then? Yeah, you could, if you still have movement, you could take oh. a nice relaxing step back as you're wa just watching the explosion. Yeah, it's like, happen. oh, oh, uh, yeah, let me step back. <laughs> As you totally see the body floating in the water. You don't want to swim with that. No, no, I don't. Okay, so Gargosh, you're all alone here. People have just abandoned you. You were the center of attention. Now you're abandoned and all alone in the, on the docks. Yeah, you, know, you can go make friends with him. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking I was going to... Or this well, one. Chicky will be coming, so... Oh yeah, I'm sure she's actually not be, uh, a schmuck. So no, because I think uh, this this guy only has one hit point over here too. He is very uh, very hurt. Well, I was thinking, yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna yell to him. This guy's proud fine. of your, proud of yourself standing by a spell while the rest of your crew dies in front of your eyes. You worthless sack of Oh, <laughs> so that's a vicious mockery on the bell ringer who's going yeah. ding 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 <laughs> yeah. going get to get your ass out of here ding 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 oh and that's going to be a wisdom saving throw and you, you roll two damage yeah two damage but just enough Ooh. oh as he Apparently looks at not. you and screws his morals and his face up into a shrew look at you, as you get a feeling when he gets a chance, he's going to pull his pistol and shoot you. <laughs> well, see how much you care about your crew, and then spit, 
fit towards him. <laughs> Anything for your movement or bonus action? Um. I don't want to do anything. Oh wait, I could inspire. Who? Who? Who needs an inspiration? I still haven't used mine yet. Oh. Give it to Lex. Uh, give it to yeah. me. I could totally I, I use it. I have inspiration. I have an inspiration. Well, well it, this is a no. bardic inspiration we're talking about. Oh, yeah, inspire yeah. me. Help me out. Sure. Yes, I will inspire. I will inspire <laughs> Mia. Okay. Um, so anytime within the next 10 minutes, you can add a D6 to a roll. Yes. Okay. And you can decide after. Yes, but Perfect. before... You, but it has to be before Jim tells you whether it hits or not. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Of course it hits or not. Okay. So Mia's got okay. the inspiration. Uh, okay. I got Could the I inspire token Gunny? Uh, you technically can inspire Gunny. Okay. I mean, I didn't, but I, I just didn't know because. Well, so I, can... I told him to, to strike true, so he's got advantage, at least this time. Oh, but that that helped the six points. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. But no, I wanted you to have it. So. Thank you. Thank you. Whenever I throw a razor wind, I'll throw it on there. Okay, Gunny's turn. Gunny's going to yep. uh, attack this dude. Uh, this dude's totally gonna, gonna Billy Club the shit out of Gunny if he gets a chance. Yes. <laughs> He's got that he's little Billy, crush. that little the, the little pan, you know, Billy Club, and he's just gonna err against poor bastard. I'm not gonna pistol whip him. <laughs> Does a twelve hit him? He's got the belaying pin, and unfortunately, yes, a twelve will hit him. <laughs> oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Turns him to mush. I, yep. I will totally say he just grabs his torso and squeezes, and he sprays him everywhere. <laughs> Since he yeah. did do four times the damage needed. <laughs> like a ketchup Perfect. packet. Ew. Then you need to move... Oh, wait, I've got the wrong button again. Hold on, I'm moving. It's a boop, 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 boop. Up here. So he's going up the stairs? Yes, because there's nobody up here right now but this dude, right? And I'm getting yep. away from this. Yep, yep, that's where I'm going. Okay, so Gunny's charging up at the guy that's been evading, you know, most of your damage. And he's going to set that guy straight. You make mommy mad. <laughs> so, Callus, what are you going to do? <sighs> so... Is this doorway open? This doorway is open, but you currently don't see anything in it yet. Well, right. From where I'm at, right? Yeah. And uh, we will totally say that this this guy is rough train here, because there's a big mech. Steam what? Jack powered down on the deck. Ah, uh, you gotta make it's it. It's just difficult terrain. Right, but what's so what's that do? Uh, double 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 costs, so it's basically ten feet per square. Ah, but it can be used oh. as cover. Ay ay ay! All right, so we'll guess we'll move here. Okay, so you're taking cover behind the crippled steam jack. Uh, underneath it. Um, we're looking in through the doorway if we can to see if we can see anything by chance. Uh, give me just a quick perception roll. Give me 12 or sure. higher and you might see something. Do, do, do. Perception. Performance. Perception. I'm just wondering how good your eyes are. Not very good. As Apparently. that steam cloud you created is just like right <laughs> in your damn face, and you're just like, <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, it was worth the try. <laughs> All right. As I totally put you on the deck there, so you can yeah. see yourself on both decks. Yep. 
And uh, are you doing anything for your action? Uh, well, no, there's nothing. To, uh, eh, why not? Since I mean, nobody you else is ready in the, action. Yeah, since nobody else is uh, apparently uh, able to take the uh, officer out, this I'll guy? go ahead and take care of that. <laughs> 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 wow, vicious the, mockery. The shade. <laughs> Who knew you had... <laughs> 15 will definitely hit. That's right at the sweet spot. As he's doing just enough. What does it look like when you blow the officer's head off? Just pop right through the skull. Just think. Pop goes the weasel. His gunny's like, I went all the way up here for this. Out one temp in one temple, out the other. <laughs> Oof. And I just kind of glance over at Mia. <laughs> so Mia, what you doing? Well, Callus is run on, so I'm going <laughs> here. <laughs> uh, uh, here we go. I'm on here. I'm hereish, and I would like here-ish. to. I'm I'm hereish. I think I'm actually that here-ish. would be water. <laughs> I thought I was on the boat. Am I not on so, the boat? You're in the boat. If you're right oh, there, okay. then you're right right here on the boat. Yes, that that's where I'm firmly on the boat. <laughs> I don't want to be on the rail. Um, and then, uh, did we hear something over in this general, like, area? Oh, you clearly heard orders coming out of this doorway that's, that's cracked okay. open, but, uh, it's not, I like, am going staying to open. hold my action for something to come out of here, and I'm going to hold a chill touch. Wait, no, I'm not going to do that because she is a tiefling. I am going to. Well, she's hold not a my... tiefling. She's she's a human that wears demonic looking armor. Yes. Oh, I thought I remember her being a tiefling. No. no, she just has a horned armor. Okay. Okay. Then yes, I will. Hold, I'll hold. She'll touch. She's and I'm going to. <laughs> I'm going to uh, Marshall Gunny and tell him to strike. True. Ooh, making sure he gets a good whack when it happens. He's going to jump off the top deck contour. (laughs) (laughs) And uh, now that Gunny is not there, and he did not take his attack of opportunity on Gunny because he was hoping, yes, keep going, keep going, go away from me, Steam Jack. I thought he died on the up. Oh, that's right, he did. He's the red mist guy. (laughs) Yeah. <laughs> as uh, just as you, you prepare to do that from inside the bellowing room you hear this stream of curses somebody's having a bad day what kind of cleric are you <laughs> as a cleric with shield and armor, and I need to get to the right st- stage. Mace in hand, and she has a glowing mace right next to her. Steps out and says, I'll kill you all for attacking my vessel. And as oh, she I, get says to, that, I get to hit her, though, because she stepped out, right? As we get... Wait, wait for it, wait for it. Oh, oh, as <laughs> she sorry, does sorry. that... I know. If she says that, that's a good place to wrap it up there. <laughs> now, don't forget that you have your chill touch held as an action, so the first thing we do is going to be you casting your chill touch. But that's now we have the classic doobie to continue drama of what's <laughs> going to happen now that the captain's out. Oh, yeah. And I have to say... You guys are total mad men and women because I thought you'd like wait till they go below deck and sneak on the boat. No, you just you know, go for it, you know, full full tilt. I'm liking this. <laughs> well, can we tell we, we, we think her left? On the boat, alive? Uh you think there could be like another, you know, ten, fifteen people on the what? boat if it was fully crewed? Remember, most most boats need like at least twenty people just to just to do the jobs on it. Well, you did say it was a tiny boat, so yeah. yeah. So there could be up to like you know ten, maybe fifteen people on the boat. 
Okay. Well, we already Can fought I what ten people, didn't we? Before we uh-huh. before we end, can I look at Callis and say I call dibs on her? <laughs> <laughs> and Callis is no. gonna look right back and say, "There's no dibs." <laughs> I'm gonna say, "No champ, no champ, <laughs> no dibs in murder." <laughs> and I go, "I've never loved you more than right now." <laughs> and, the, and the and the steam jack counted as two. <laughs> it counts as one. <laughs> I know that one guy. I couldn't kill him to save my life, man. The and gods were I on did. his side. I have used up all my twenties for the rest of this character's life. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. You'll just roll some more ones to make them back. There you go. Yeah. Right. I mean, Theo has had a bad run of things from time to time. This is just karma making up for it. <laughs> and it was a perfect time for a 20. Yeah, yeah it really was. You did amazing. Neither, None of us have died yet, and uh, Theo has <laughs> opponent of us up, so win. Yeah. Oh, no, she cursed us. <laughs> yeah. And more Almost. importantly, Gunny is still on his feet. And not in water. Yeah. Yay, win. And almost none of us <laughs> took any damage. In the water. Yeah, that's true. The ship is taking negligible damage. Yeah, you and Gunny are the. You and Gunny are like the only damage, I think. Yeah. Did Gunny get damaged? Oh yeah. And yeah, he took he took a good shot. He took a bullet to He's, the brain. Yeah, he's he's down. Yeah. <laughs> but he's still good, but he's still got 16. Yeah. Yeah. So, cool. Well, thank you. That was a lot of fun. I love um, it when a plan comes us. together that we didn't have. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I had a high-level idea, so. This is was this pretty it? much what, what it was planned to be. Oh. <laughs> uh, See, I was thinking we'd sneak on and be sneaky and just steal it, but I was like, oh, smash and grab, smash and grab it is. Frontal assault. Much easier. That was what I pictured. (laughs) That's kind of what improvise means to me. (laughs) Like I said, I I had a high-level thought. (laughs) Exactly exactly what that was going to look like. (laughs) Um, it was fun. Thank you all. Uh, my wife and granddaughter just got home, so I have to go. Um, goodbye. Bye. See you tonight. Bye, everyone. Y'all. Thanks. Bye. 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 All right. Later, all. Thank you for listening to D&D Journey of the Fifth Edition, a member of the Creative Play and Podcast Network. Please follow us on Patreon at patreon.com forward slash CPPN to never miss a show or stream.